Hello everyone, this is Airside Winterthorn. Um, so this, uh, I'm about to film um, a video um, here in this location. Um, it just sort of struck me that this is the last time I will be filming in this location. It's not the first time that I've moved locations to new, new places. Um, but this one has been special and I just sort of want to commemorate that. This has been the first place where I've had people be respectful of the ma uh, what I'm doing, or I've had people come out and like, like, uh, like I'm, I'm completely surrounded by houses on all sides. So whenever I'm doing this, I'm putting on a show for everyone around the area. So if you are from this area, I know a couple of you have sub sub subscribed. Um, thank you so much for your support um, these past couple of months, um, about five, February, March, April, May, June five months now um so thank you all for your support the past couple months i know at the beginning um it was a little weird trying to get ad adapted to me doing this i know there was a little bit of heckling going on um but the people here have been very supportive and very very friendly a couple have come out and talked to me um all kept their distance of course because uh, they're never going to uh, covid and all that um but this what i'm about to film will be the last time that I will be training in this area um, that I know of, unless I just happen to be passing through this area with my lightsabers, which is unlikely. Um, I'm going to be moving. I'm still going to be in Loughborough. I'll still be around, um, but um, I, I don't know exactly where I'm going to be training yet. I've been scoping out the area, uh, and I have a couple air places that I've chosen out. Uh, however, this area. Because I'm going to be working like crazy for the next couple days and then I'm moving. Um, so it's going to be very different to be a little bit of a change. Um, the reason why this place has like encouraged me is because I've had literal encouragement in person. Uh, people who like like kids come and sit and they watch. Um, people say that they've just like, like, oh, I'll just be doing my dishes and I'll look out the window and I'll see you training. It's been, it's lovely. It just gives me something to watch while I'm doing something that just otherwise isn't the greatest. Um, it's been very encouraging and it's really pushed me to go to new levels. This is the area that I did my first saber staff practice. Uh, this is the area that I did my first uh, authentic saber pike practice, where I started getting a little bit more into Jarkai, where I started doing reverse grip uh, Jarkai, um, which was previously people said it just wasn't um, a thing that you could really do. Uh, I started doing shorts in this area. Um, so this area has been a little bit special, it's been a little bit different uh, as opposed to my other areas which were usually um, like a little bit more secluded. Like even if I was surrounded, people usually kept their distance. Uh, back in Canada I had the same sort of setup, but nobody came out, mostly because it was winter and it sucked. Um, and I also wasn't really great, it wasn't like I was anyone notice notable at that time. I'm approaching four years of having done this. They're doing this lightsaber stuff now. Uh, June 30th, June 30th, I'm going to try to have a special video out, which will commemorate the four years of me doing this. Um, I still have, like, this lightsaber, it's changed over the years. It used to be a Saber Forge Dissident, and now it has, like, a Templar pommel. It has a uh, Defcon Bird leather. It has a fallen grip. Like this section here, from here to here, is original. So it's the exact same battery compartment. I've had to solder it myself once when the battery came out. The LED, of course, is different. It used to be white. Um, this is a custom length blade from JQ Sabres rather than the 37 inch uh, blade that I started out with. Um, I still have that 37 inch. It's just, if I'm gonna use a 37 inch, I'm gonna end up using my river blade. Um, but this, this is the, the perfect length for me, a 34. Um, but yeah, this place has really helped me grow a lot. I'm very thankful for the people in the area for encouraging me, um, putting up with my uh, random park raves, um, the glow stick raves in, in the park. Um, maybe I'll see everybody around, who knows. But I'm going to be moving a little bit further away, so it's good. it would really have to be a trip to come out here. Um, yeah, I'm not going to go on too long. Um, I think the sun is just about getting perfect. 
Yeah, just about perfect for a video, so it's time to uh, to get on that. So thank you all for watching. May the force continue to guide you.